with me in the country. And uh, he, he sat down with me. We were just doing our own routine, but he was just sitting there. He was just smiling. He was just carrying on. And then when we got ready to leave, he said, man, I had such a good time. I said, well, man, what, what, what did you enjoy? We didn't do nothing but sit on the porch and drink coffee and just talk. He said, but man, I enjoyed being in that particular atmosphere because I could see that there was nothing but love on that porch. Why? I didn't think of nothing. Because we're always cooking and eating, always bringing stuff to somebody else. We were just gathering and somebody would just say, well, throw out some fish, throw out some chicken wings, and go in there and call, let them know what I'm talking about. And we just start eating and just start talking and enjoying ourselves. We don't think, they don't think of, not thinking anything of it. But as I'm getting older, I'm beginning to realize that no matter what we go and do in life, no matter what I accomplish, no matter who I become, if I don't have love, I don't have much of anything. And so if you have somebody in your family that loves you, somebody in your family that calls you, checks on you, and if you're guilty like I am, I have family that I don't call and check on like I know it's people to. So as much as I'm preaching this message, I'm being convicted as well. Because I have a brother that I don't even call like I should. He calls me. But I'm so busy. So busy about being in the business of being who I am. That I don't stop and take the time to call him, text him. And then there's some others, there's some others out here who, who just as guilty as I am. But we got to learn, know, and understand that love is everything. Love is everything. What's love got to do with it? Love has everything. Happy friends and family days. Do your best hope we thank God again for this opportunity. Show love. Show love. Because Jesus first loved us. Amen. Yeah. Come on, we got to go ahead and pray. Whatever it is, God is calling
and a loving couple. And then a, a new youthful and budding couple that God brought at the same time. Isn't that beautiful? And then here, I'm going to ask you, all of the men and women, the strong, pretty men and women, the million number, come forward and surround them. Let's show them how much we love them. Come on down. Come on down. Let's surround them. Love on them. And pray for them that God will cover them. That God will keep them. That God will be them.